My name is Anthony Murray. I'm uh, 18. I'm from a little village called Borfoot in the Glen Vandrum. I'm a young carer. I care for my mother who has hippocampal cirrhosis, which is effectively epilepsy. Every time you leave the house, you always have your phone close at hand just in case you need you get a phone call to say you need to rush home. So you're always it's always at the back of your mind thinking, right, is she gonna be okay today? Is today gonna to be a good day or is today gonna be a stressful day? Like I remember at the start of lockdown actually, we went up a walk up a, a local mountain. She had a seizure at the top of the mountain and that is on parallel uh, amount of stress there. But the thing is, you're always thinking, well at least I was there and at least we as a family could work together to solve that. Because of the medication she's on for epilepsy, she then has challenges with her immune system. And because of that, she can't go to the shops anymore because it's too much of a risk for us. She can't go out and talk to people and just have like small wee conversations that would really actually like improve her mental health. You're in a rut then because you don't have a routine because your normal support network that you've had, going out and talking to friends, like being sociable, that has, that has a massive impact on particularly me because then it helps me then have more of a support network outside of the family. I've seen definitely has, has had a massive effect on um, on how I sort of function now and what has become a very challenging time. There definitely is more young carers out there that just aren't recognised by the system. There's more carers out there that just aren't recognised as health carers. You don't really recognise yourself as this whole big like care and role sort of thing. For you, it's just something you you do naturally because they're part of their family and they love them. <laughs>